Hey guys, just want to take a second to talk to you about our Yak Stick product. The Rogue Yak Stick really is the best stick on the market. Um, where we've added value in this product is with our expertise and our ability to do additional testing to ensure that all labels are accurate and that the stick really is what we say it is. Um, over the time that we've been looking at this product, we've sourced from at least five different sources and four out of the five had problems with information contained on their nutritional analysis um, or with ingredients, which is probably the more scary of the two. So what did we find in our time looking at these different sticks? Well, we found that many had claims of higher fat content than they actually had. Other sticks had extremely low fat content and high fiber content. And when you're advertising that all these sticks have the exact same ingredients, you have to start wondering why is there a difference in things like fiber or fat? Well, after doing our third party testing, it became clear the issue is that a certain group of these sticks are actually being cut with potatoes. And we actually got that directly from one of the source when we really pinned them down on it. So they're actually cutting the stick with potato starch. Now, would potato starch necessarily harm your dog? Uh, most likely not, but there are a group of dogs that are allergic to potatoes. And as owners, we should be able to trust the labels that we're looking at so that we can make informed decisions for our pets. So we continue to test every batch of sticks that we get for accuracy on nutrition. And also that will let us know if there's ever something changed. So if we see our fat go out of whack or we see our protein content go real high, we'll know that we're no longer getting real yak milk and cow milk. Uh, you know, whole cow milk, whole yak milk. Um, this is one of the things that's really interesting. So when you see really low fat, like 0.9%, the question becomes, well, why are you even saying there's yak milk in there? There's not a good source of skim yak milk that we've ever heard of. So they don't make it. Um, and at that point, you're just, you're just misleading people into thinking they're getting some sort of unique product and charging a premium value, even though you're buying cheaper ingredients. And that's not what we're about. So you know when you buy a rogue yak stick that you're getting the top quality, the best consistency, the best color, the best density of any stick that we've been able to source. And we want to, we want to make sure that everybody has that choice on knowing the ingredients are accurate as well. So if you're looking for something to keep your dog busy, if you've got a, a chewer, you can give them something that's highly digestible that actually adds value to their diet. Um, this gives them good fat and good protein, and you can know that it's safe. Thanks.